Alright, so what is up guys? My name is Creator. Welcome back to another gameplay of Hogwarts Legacy and this will be the part 11. Hell yeah! I hope you guys are doing well, so sit back and enjoy this gameplay that I'm about to show you guys. But before we begin... Previously on Hogwarts Legacy That's it. This is for Rookwood. No. Expelliarmus. No one to share in my victory. Akio. Now, now, I'm only trying to help. Let me also. Yeah, in the previous part, we fought with Victor Rookwood underlings. We set out to find the helmet of Urquhart and we managed to retrieve it. And I fought with them terribly. I do not want to explain much more further, but apparently I'm still not custom to controllers. So yeah, and we learn more about Biss, which slightly interesting. We can capture them and store them in our room of requirement. Yeah, there's a limited space for, for them that I can store them in my room. So, for the rest of them, I can sell them at Brood and Pack. And that's about it. Part 10 recap. So, for now, we are gonna upgrade our broom. So, Mr. LB, what you got for us? You're back. Nice to see you again. Yes, an enchantment that increases your brooms and acceleration speed. Okay. You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you. I must tell you, half of Ogsmead's been by the shop asking about rumours of a broom upgrade. Without the information you provided, my work would have taken twice as long. Thank you again. It may sound ambitious, but I've already begun work on another upgrade, more difficult to perfect than the last. I wondered, would you be interested in joining forces again? There's another course near Irondale that Miss Reyes has mastered. If you were to test this first upgrade there, it may help me as I develop the next. Oh, you'll consider it, won't you? Obviously, more upgrades for me then. Sounds as if you're really outdoing yourself. If I'm able to help, I will. Thank you. I know this recent success was only the beginning of what I can do for Broom Flight. Report back as soon as you can, and we'll be off to the races. Thanks, man. Thanks for the upgrade. Let me stop by by uh, Mr. Pippin. Let me stock on some potion. We have everything a young student might need when it comes to potions. Have a good look around. So. A wise decision. Thank you. Thank you. Maxima Focus We need focus Oh shit I hope to see you again Farewell for now What can I do for you today? I hope to see you again Farewell for now It's 2,335. How far is it? Oh, wow. OK. 
Okay. Yeah, it's too far. Okay, the plan is simple. Let me get some upgrades first. The well, plan is to clear this uh, ancient magic hotspot and Merlin trial. And I'll be back. A few moments later. Okay, so I've completed... Uh, how many trials are there? I mean, no, no, not trials, it's sports. Yeah. Magic hot sports. So I've com completed six of them. Well, it's easy to find them, so yeah. And Merlin trial, I've completed six of them as well. <laughs> uh, apparently, I ran out of mellow sweets, so yeah, that is it. I've explored some of the areas. Yeah, as you can see here, there's a bunch of Merlin trials. I mean, it took me like 45 minutes to complete like what, six of them? To find them and the magic hotspot. So I was like, if you do stuff repeatedly, you get bored eventually. So yeah, onwards to Imelda. It's time for a race. Hello, Imelda. So, another trial? Of course it's another trial. And you'd better be taking part. Does this mean you've changed your mind about me? Well, you're a step up from the good-for-nothings who usually challenge me. While they sit around and hope to be the best, I put in hours of practice. No one sets records by wishing for them. And I need strong competition to stay on top of my game. Are you going to try to beat my flying record or not? Obviously, man. Come on. Let's go. I'm ready to fly. Finally. A decent challenge. Okay, here we go. Right. Hey. Why is that broom so fast? I'd say that was acceptable. Oh. Brilliant. Hey, okay, here we go. It's all right. It's cool. Wait. We got this, we got this. It's easy. It's easy, right? It's easy. Fail it. Brilliant. Getting the hang of this. <laughs> now that's more like it. Hey, come on, Greta. This is easy. Easy. Come on. All right. I'm getting used to the control. I guess. Well, I don't want to be. I don't want to sound like overconfident. But hey, the more you use your hand. The more proficiency you're gonna get. That was acceptable. I guess. Well, uh, don't take any advice from me. I am an idiot after all. Alright. Is this the last one? Yep. Full speed ahead. And yeah. Could be the record. This is wrong. That was easy. You've improved, I must admit. That was a bloody good run. Be careful. Earn a reputation for talent around here, and some people get put out about it. Sounds like you're speaking from experience. Yes, well, I am. Anyway, you didn't do abysmally. I can't deny that. But you'll not have the same luck on the South Coast course. Okay. We'll see, won't we? Till next time. I half expected you to back down. Rest on your laurels. See you at the South Coast trial, if you don't lose your nerve. Yeah, yeah. To race this course again, visit the podium with the leaderboard. 
where you can start the race and check your time. Okay. Bye. Another successful flight. I should let Mr. Weeks know. Oh, two upgrades, huh? Isn't that great? After this upgrade, then we finally go to the main quest. Alright, Mr. Weeks, come here. Mr. Weeks, eh? Just because you know Luma. Back from your latest flight. Hey. I want to hear all the particulars. Alright. Good news, Mr. Weeks. With your upgrade, I was able to set a new record at the Irondale course. Brilliant! I knew the upgrade had fantastic potential. How did your broom feel? It rides well. Let's get a tad shaky at top speed, and the handle wobbles a bit when I hit a strong gust of wind. Ah, yes. Hmm, I see. I think I know how to address that. Thank you. I owe you one. If it means another upgrade, the pleasure's all mine. You sound as determined as I am to improve broom flight. It's a joy to have a collaborator like yourself. If I'm right, and I do hope I am, you'll be hearing good news from me soon. Thank you again, truly. What are we looking for today? So there's no upgrade yet, okay? Thanks it's for okay. stopping by. Hope to see you again. Mr. Weeks and I do make a good team. Alright, that was a good side quest. And I'm guessing my level... My, by leveling up, it's fine. But I'm almost dead. Oh, oh saw something. Hopefully I can Rebellion. level up. Come here. What's this? Hogs meat. <laughs> Finally, hogs meat. <laughs> Not enough. Well, that's okay. Uh, yeah, I forgot to mention during my my run with the side quest, I've upgraded some of my spells. Well, right now my stupefy got a longer period to stun the enemy. And the other one is Protego Expertise. Uh, basically, it sends two projectiles to different enemies. And it's quite handy. And the next upgrade will be obviously the potions though. One well, of my potions. I need them to increase a bit longer. So yeah. Right. Let me grab some Wigan Weld. And... We can continue with Sebastian, our buddy Sebastian. Hello, Mr. Sammy. What do you have for sale? You have Wigan Well? What can I help you with today? Hell yeah. Ah, yes. A wonderful choice. A top hat. Okay. I hope to see you again sometime. All right, bye-bye. Sebastian, Sebastian, okay. Felt, Feltcroft, I think, I, I, I think that's how you pronounce it, so. Oh, shh. Damn it, damn, damn. Oh my goodness. All right, and now. I thought once we've done with the Malda race and we got an upgrade, apparently no. We have to wait, I guess. So yeah. Oh man. This is gonna be a long ass journey. My my my. Onwards, oh my goodness. This is so far. And here we are in Feltcroft. That was one journey though. It's far. Alright, Sebastian. Let's see your sister. Hey man. You made it. Obviously, man. I made I will make time for you. 
Enjoying the view. Keeping an eye on things. Feldcroft isn't what it used to be. No one has felt safe here since Ranrock's loyalists took a peculiar interest in that castle over there. Rookwood Castle. My uncle Solomon is a former Aura and refuses to look into it, even after Anne was cursed by one of them. Possibly with a wand, no less. I heard a goblin refer to wizard kind as wand carriers. A goblin's forbidden from carrying wands. Precisely. That's why I'm on the hunt for answers. If I'm to cure her, I need to understand what happened to her. Anne was always the most mischievous of the three of us. Which is saying something, knowing me and Ominous. I'm hoping a surprise visit from me and a new friend from Hogwarts will help lift her spirits. Bring back the Anne I used to know. Come on. I'll take you to my uncle's. Alright, let's go. This way. Where? Oh. Wait. Southcroft used to be a lot livelier. With Ranrock's lot wandering about all the time, everyone stays out of sight. Here we hey, are. Wonderful house. My sister should be just inside. Oh, you're not gonna open the door for me. And where are your manners? Hello. How is everybody doing? Aha! Sebastian, where did you? Is that what I think it is? We've been over this, boy. Hey. Shrivel figs cannot reverse a curse. Nothing can. The sooner you accept that reality, the better. But we haven't tried everything. There is no cure! When will you accept that? Never! I can never accept it. <laughs> now look what you've done. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> You all right? I'm sorry you had to see that. If you don't mind, I just need a moment alone. Carry on. Poor Sebastian. Not the visit he'd hoped for. Yeah. How about we speak to his uncle, right? That Solomon. boy will fray my last nerve. Your man, chill. Excuse me, Mr. Sallow. Oh, yes. Sebastian's friend. I apologize on behalf of my nephew. He doesn't know when to stop. He thinks he can help Anne, oh, but nothing can be done for her. I understand you've tried everyone from Nurse Blaney to St. Mungo's to no avail. We have. My nephew thinks he knows better than the healers. Perhaps the healers don't know everything, sir. Sebastian is single-mindedly focused on finding a way to help his sister. If there is a cure, he will find it. Your faith in Sebastian is misplaced. Some sort of dark magic cursed Anne, and the goblins aren't likely to explain themselves any time soon. Giving her hope is cruel. The only thing to do now is keep Anne comfortable and stay out of the Loyalists' way. Well, hope can be, yeah. With all due respect, sir, hope could keep Anne's spirits up. You may mean well, but I know what's best for Anne and Sebastian. They are my stubborn brother's children, especially Sebastian. If you really want to be of help, you'll make sure Sebastian does what he should do, not what he wants to do. He's no idea the harm he could do if he doesn't stop. I hope you'll remember what I've said. Good day. I'm going to do everything I can to help Sebastian, man. Everything. Now it's time to speak to Anne. Sorry about earlier. Those bouts of pain are difficult to bear. That's all right. You don't have to apologize. Are you all right, Anne? I didn't mean to intrude. You didn't, truly. <laughs> and I'm all right. The pain from this curse comes in bouts. And often suddenly, it's not anyone's fault. It's nice to meet you, by the way. You must be the new fifth year Sebastian told me about. I am. Sebastian and I met during a rather lively duel in defense against the dark arts. Oh dear, Professor Hecate. She's a powerful witch. And she knows how to keep students like my brother, and me, in line. I do miss Hogwarts. 
but I wouldn't mind being in Feldcroft, really, if it wasn't so dreary now. Between the goblins at the castle and my uncle fighting with Sebastian whenever he's home, it's not the cosy retreat it once was. Sebastian mentioned something about your uncle being an ex-Aura, but refusing to go after Ranrock's loyalists. I must say, I wasn't prepared for him to be as angry as he was. Uncle Solomon is frustrated by what happened to me and by Sebastian for thinking he can fix it. They both mean well, I know they do, but my uncle is right. This curse cannot be undone. I can feel it. Sebastian cannot take away my pain. Perhaps you can help him to understand that. I can try, yeah, um, yeah. I'll do my best. I can promise to speak with him about it. Thank you. His search for a cure is futile, I'm afraid. I'm getting tired. I should probably rest. Thank you for stopping by. Problem, man. I Rebellion. I ought to see how Sebastian's faring. A letter from N to Sebastian Sallow. This is my portion, kid, not your sleeve, my things be. N. <laughs> Mischievous, I guess. Well, siblings are like that. Dear yeah, N, Hogwarts isn't the same without you. Well, shop is still as foul. But you know what I mean. I hope you're feeling better. Sebastian. Oh, there's an apple. Okay. Maybe we can cure her with ancient magic? Maybe. I don't Why know. Why will he not listen to me? She's my sister. How are you doing, Sebastian? You got a first-hand glance at what I'm dealing with. I apologize for my uncle. It's all right. I know he's angry, but he's only trying to do what he thinks is best for Anne. He's always angry. He's been angry since my parents died. After Anne was hurt, he only grew worse. It's as though he blames me somehow, always calling me my father's son, as if that's an insult. I'm the one trying to help her. He's simply given up. Both Anne and your uncle seem genuinely convinced that nothing more can be done for her. I refuse to believe that. Anne's pain is more than physical. It has changed her entirely. I miss my sister. And I'm going to get her back. Come with me. I need to show you where it happened. <laughs> Ranrock's loyalists are capable of so much more than people realize. They should not be underestimated. Okay. Will do. All the debris you'll see is from whatever's going on at that abandoned estate. They've been digging for something. Okay, where? Up there, on that plateau, is where they cursed Anne. This way. Why was your sister there in the first place? Whoa. Ready to dig through this rubble. Ramrock knows what he's doing. It's an honor to be a part of it. Only good wizard is a dead hey, come wizard. On. Demo? Right, bring it, boys. I mean, goblin. Get Maxima. Yeah. Right. More damage. Get this. Why can't I hit you? I hate that! This is 
so much. Get away! Stop it! Almost! Uh, let me see. Yeah. There you go. Okay, this is a shit show. Okay. Come on, Kiddo. Final spell? I confess, that was a bit more than I bargained for. Oh. I tried to warn Oh, you. level up. Revelio. Anything else here? Yep, that's about it. Okay, let's see. Those loyalists deserved what they got. Couldn't agree more. This is where it happened. We smelled smoke in the middle of the night. When we looked outside, flames were shooting from the estate. Before my uncle and I could stop her, Anne rushed out, racing towards the fire, worried someone would be hurt. She came face to face with a horde of goblins, frantically trying to stamp out the flames. Suddenly, an icy voice drifted out from somewhere in the smoke. Children should be seen and not heard. A blinding blast followed. They didn't even give her a chance to run. Hey, that was so detailed, man. Uh, yeah. It seems an awfully violent response to a child wandering by. What were they trying to hide? My thoughts exactly. It may be grasping at Billywigs, but I keep thinking that there might be something here that could lead me to whoever cursed Anne. Might be the only way to learn what type of magic harmed her, which could help me find a cure. Perhaps you're right. The loyalists are everywhere, but they do seem to be spending a lot of time here, and it's likely they're hiding something. And at Rookwood Castle. Shall we have a look around? Sure. They seem to have set up camp here for a specific reason. They have stations for everything. It's time to look around. Revelio. Right, first clue? Whose home was this? Been abandoned long since I've lived here. Rumor was a Hogwarts professor lived here once, centuries ago. But that's all I ever heard. This. I've heard the goblin dig sites like these are popping up everywhere. Hmm. It's a wonder the ministry isn't doing more. Can we go up here? Oh, damn it. Okay, more clues to find. More enemies, I guess. Oh! What is this? We got a coin ready. Whoa. Are they preparing for a war? Okay. Get back to Sebastian. Oh, such yeah, I did. Okay, there's one more here. My bad, my bad. I'm guessing they are preparing for a war. Always armed and ready for a fight, Ranrock's loyalists. It might be worth taking a closer look at the house itself. I did. I didn't find anything. Okay, let's look at the house then. It'll be right here. Rebellion. So well here. And there's a bench. This well looks familiar. Doesn't look familiar to me. Uh, okay. Sebastian, I've seen this before. This house, the well, the view. What do you mean? When? Give me a moment. I'll explain in a second. Revelio. I don't remember. Of 
coin. Sebastian, over here. Do you think that this was damaged by the fire the night that Anne was cursed? Could be. But it looks to me as though this was intentional. Sebastian, this house did belong to a Hogwarts professor hundreds of years ago. Who? What do you... I found a pensive that day in the restricted section with a memory that showed this house. There was a little girl and a drought. The keepers oh. have shown me other memories as well. The girl became a Hogwarts professor. Her name was Isadora Morganark. She was one of the keepers. The keepers? Like in Quidditch? And you found a pensive in the library? I'm not following you. I realize it's a lot to take in. I'm not even sure I understand. <laughs> yeah, it's not yet. like Quidditch. And no, not like Quidditch. They call themselves keepers because they're protecting some type of knowledge. It has to do with the vault at Gringotts. Let me see if I've got this straight. You have Ranrock and Rookwood after you because of something you found at Gringotts where you ended up via a port key. All right. You can see traces of an ancient magic that you think Ranrock is trying to harness. And now you've been witnessing memories left by keepers. Yep. Oh, and this house belonged to a Hogwarts professor who was one of these non-Quidditch keepers hundreds of years ago. All if right. I didn't know you, I think you were pulling my leg. It is all a bit much, isn't it, when you put it like that? The point is, we both have good reason to search this house. You for answers about what happened to Anne, and me for answers about the keepers. Look at this. Someone piled this here for a reason. Well, start to destroy it. Locking something? Only one way to find out. Huh, a stairwell. Oh. oh. Why is it so misty? Hmm. Huh. What the hell is that? Why bother blocking a stairwell? There might be something here worth a closer look. They've left Rebellion. all simply strewn about. Tells me they're after something bigger. Hey, explore the cellar. Mm. To learn Charles hope. So man living camp today. The one who also reminded me of my father. Huh? Seems these journal entries are from Isadora's travels. Oh, this was the first one, okay. Ah oh, damn, okay, uh Uh-huh. I'm beginning to think that the others are wrong and I have the power to help these souls. It seems as arbitrary not to help them as it would be to read of them. A journal entry of his adorers. I should hold on to this. Revelio! Way to find out is to blast them away. Incendio. I guess I was right. You're not going to believe this. I can see the Undercroft. What? A daydream? Because that happens to me too. No, Sebastian. This is the Undercroft. I know it sounds strange, but... Honestly, I nothing you say sounds strange to me anymore. Fair <laughs> enough. I can see the Undercroft through this stone wall as though it's a window. This has happened before. I'm listening. I think it's to do with my ability to see traces of ancient magic. But you said you didn't really understand it and that you couldn't wield it. That's true. And I'm still not sure what it all means. What I do know is that my ability allows me to travel through these windows I see. Wait. We can get straight to the Undercroft from here. <laughs> Ominous will be flawed. We can. But perhaps best not to tell anyone else about this for now. Even ominous. Understood. Well then, invisible secret ancient magic passageway. Here we come. Oh, at least we I'm can... I'm tempted to hold my breath. We can cheer him up, right? It's good to see him smile. For a bit. Be now? Why would you the door lead us here? <laughs> Sebastian, look. It wasn't here when we came.
A torn picture. Can we cast Repairo on it? Repairo. Why hide a triptych here? Seems as if something's missing. A note. Let's have a look. Hey, rune diagram. Oh, it's got to do something with ancient magic. Anything helpful something. in the Something. Nope. Nothing. A rune symbol. I've seen similar symbols used by the keepers. I've been thinking. A keeper lived in that house centuries ago, and Ranrock and his lot have been searching there. You said that goblins may be wielding some form of this ancient magic. Do you think Anne was cursed by ancient magic? I can't be sure, of course, but I don't think so. I didn't see any traces of it around your sister. Hmm. Very well. But that doesn't mean it's not ancient magic. There's still so much we don't know about it. True. Perhaps this triptych will lead us to answers. Then we'll have to unravel what this all means. But now I need to see Ominous. Don't worry, I won't tell him anything. Did I mention that, apparently, Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here, in Hogwarts? You did not. Sounds worth looking into. Any idea where in the castle? No idea. Ominous just learned of it. I'll let you know what I find out. I had no idea our visit to Sian would unfold into all of this. My head's an utter mess. But I'm glad you told me everything you did. I'll be in touch. Till then. Right. In the shadow of the estate, complete. So, uh... What's next? I don't know. Falbutton Castle. After dark, do not tell anyone. Why do? <laughs> and I know where our next stop will be. Professor Garlic. Since High Keep required Regardium Leviosa, so we're we gonna attend Herbology class. Here we go. Hello. She looks too young to be a professor, right? Oh, oh, that's Chinese chomping cabbage. Damn, that thing are vicious, right? Alright, class over. We got him, Leviosa, on the way. Ma'am. How wonderful to see you again. I've completed my assignments, Professor. Pleased to hear it. Professor Weasley will be too. I'll be sure to let her know how well you're coming along. Thank you, Professor. Professor Hecate tells me she taught you Levioso, so you should be ready for a more advanced levitation charm. Wingardium Leviosa requires a bit of concentration and a nice, graceful wand movement. Let's see you try your hand at it. When executed correctly, you should be able to pick up boulders as though they were sprigs of sneezewort. Oh, really? I did not know that. Oh, it's not a battle spell. It's... I think a utility spell. Okay. Fine tune direction. Oh. Alright. Well done! Feel free to practice Wingardium Leviosa here in the greenhouse. I've set some crates out for you in the next room. Okay, thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Let me see here. Oh, wrong. Ligarium Leviosa. Oh, wrong spell. Ligarium Leviosa. You're a natural. Oh. Whoa. Can go up. It's cool. Hey, Dithney. It's my old Dithney. Alright. Uh, let's see. Into the shadows, kidnap cabbage. Okay, uh, how about yeah, we talk to Serona, huh? It's a side quest, so yeah. 
since i'm sorry since she helped us you know the first time we went to the tree broomstick so yeah let's let's help her out the resource indeed your field guide i'm most pleased to be included right oh is this halloween whoa what pumpkin juice <laughs> oh you fluffy boy all right back to serona all right madam serona wait miss miss serona yeah miss serona i'm here hello serona i received your owl how are you hello my friend did you ever find lord gog uh yep i did thank you we had a good conversation he sends you his best. Glad to hear it. I shan't ask for details of your little chat, and I'll refrain from telling you to be careful yet again. But I hope you will be, whatever your plans. I, of course. Your owl mentioned you're needing my help with something? I do. I thought you might be just the person to do a favor for my friend Dorothy Sprottle in Upper Hogsfield. Hmm. I don't believe I've met Mrs. Sprottle. She's lovely. Her late husband, Aidan, was a friend of my father's. In fact, I'd stay with Dot and Aidan the summers I waited tables here as a student. I've seen her a few times since Aidan passed, but the pub's been so busy lately, I've not been as attentive as I'd have liked. I wonder if you might pop in and see her. She may need some help collecting ingredients for her supply of Wigan World potion. And you could retrieve something of mine in the process. A box, um, full of old letters and such. Oh, let me see. Yeah. Why did Mr. and Mrs. Sprottle have your box of letters after all this time? It's one of a few that I had when I was young. Dot found it when she was clearing out a closet. Can't imagine what's in there. Probably terribly theatrical. The ramblings of a teenage witch and her friends. You're welcome to take a peek inside, if you do find it. To be honest, I'd imagine it contains some lovely memories. Okay. Sure. I'll try to go and see her when I can. It would mean the world to me, and to Dorothy. Aidan was bringing the box of letters to me when he was taken ill. Dot can tell you where he might have dropped it. You'll find the hamlet just north of Hogsmeade. Please do give Dot my love. Yeah. Will do. Well, I'm helping you out since you're the best, right? She helped us with. Let me see. What's his name? Something Rookwood? Yeah. <laughs> okay. But before we start that quest, I have talents. Yeah. I want to do this potion. Well, Maxima Potion causes attack to have additional increased damage. And break enemy shield down. That's worth my time. So let's see the map. Where is it? Whoa! What's with this quest and the. Oh my goodness. Did I went there? Nope. What's this called? Infamous foe. Huh. All right. Oh, can speak to her. A few bones. Are you in some sort of trouble? Nearly attacked by wolves, I was. Only just escaped with my life. I need to be better prepared next time. Could use some thunder brew. I don't suppose a student like yourself would be in possession of such a thing? Ah, uh, I don't have any. I'm afraid not. I'd help you if I could, but I don't actually have anything with me. Well, that is unfortunate. I was hoping you'd be better prepared. Uh, I'll come to you as soon as I have that thunder brew. But for now, all the best. Uh, can we go to... Yes, I'm curious. Yes. Then we can wait. What's infamous for? Oh. That reminds me of the Punisher. Oh, 
Oi, dung boy. Where is it? Another one. Uh, let me check. <laughs> let me check. Uh, what's their weakness though? Let me see. Leviso can be used on its fleshy tongue to hoist it in. Okay. Alright. Alright, big boy. Let me gain my distance. Levioso. Ah, uh, too late. Incendio. Good for you. Let me Oh, get too late, too late. Let me There you go. Whoa. All right, big boy, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Okay, okay, okay. No play around. Ultimate spell coming up. Wait. Oh, that was the infamous foe. Okay. What the hell? Yo. What? You guys good? Okay, hi. Alright. Okay. <laughs> that was weird. Onwards. It seems as though things are getting worse. Best be on my thought dark magic was the answer. Hey, man. I reckon Rookwood's played a hand in his disappearance. Hello, Mrs. Sprottle. Actually, Serona Ryan asked if I'd come and see you. Oh, dear Serona, a gem has been for as long as I've known her. She thought you might need help collecting ingredients for your Wigan World potion. And she's correct. My darling Aiden used to collect hawk lumps for me. Since he died, my supply has dwindled. I'm sorry for your loss, Mrs. Brottle. Oh, thank you. Love of my life. A bit lost without him. If you wouldn't mind gathering some hawk clumps for me, I'd be happy to compensate you for your time. I can certainly try and find some for you. That would be wonderful. I'm worried about the travelling vendors and would love to get them more Wiganweld potion. Serona also mentioned that Mr Sprottle was bringing her a box of letters when he fell ill. Indeed he was. I'd almost forgotten. I stumbled upon it just before Aidan died. He was hoping to go through it with Serona over a butterbeer or two. Uh, those two were always like two bow truckles in a branch. Aidan took ill when he was collecting hawk clumps on his way to see her. He made it home, but I fear he dropped the box in the cavern. The cavern is in the hills just southwest of our hamlet. You can gather hawk clumps and collect the box of letters there. Uh, I don't want to pry any further, so yeah, let's go. Thank you, Mrs. Brottle. 
thank you. I'll be here if you are able to collect those hawk lumps. I, and the vendors I help, would greatly appreciate it. I will do, ma'am. Uh, Kevin, Kevin. Why is it? No, it's not that far. Let's go. Kevin. Nope. Not today. You this must be the cavern Mrs. Brussel mentioned. Hmm. Nice. You need debt, right? Rebellio. A lot of debt. For the madame. Yo, what's what's this place? Ah, uh, okay. This is not good. Like ten. Better have a look around. See about the hawk clumps and the box of letters. Incendio! That's at least one hawk clump. Oh, why is it here? Nothing special. Let's go. Hawk clump, nice. Getting there. Just a few more hawk clumps to harvest. Yo, what's this place? I'm Batman. Uh, let me see the bolso maybe. Uh, that's not the bolso. So, okay, let's go. Uh, okay. A clown. Go. Or avoid it altogether. No, we have to fight. Hey, big boy. Miss me. Nah. Oh, that needs to be damaged. Uh, let me get Maxim, alright? Oh, Accidentally going to. Okay, I got the what? No chance of that. Miss me. Good bring up. Send up. Place it. Incendi. Can bring up. Uh, let me see. Stand down. Should think they felt like in London. Oaklum, nice. That's all the whole clumps for now. Mrs. Sprottle should be pleased. Um. Revelio. Should we go? Here maybe. What a small whole clump. This place is huge. Okay, Greta, we can't go there. Hmm. Squirrel. Okay. Okay, we can go there. Let me aim. Oh, more hot glum. More for me there. Oh, there's a bunch of them. Nice. What? Thank you. I've got 30 coins in that process, so... It's a win. Oh, get up. It says it's on top of here, but... Revelio. Oh, does one go there? That's the question. We will find soon enough. Oh, what's this? Oh, nice. Uh. 
Okay, collect Serona's letters and box. Roger that. Okay, I'm not gonna read that. No, hell no. This must be Serona's box of letters. Forbidden Forest. Uh, wait. Let me explore this place first. I think that's everything. So I'll, I'll be, be back glad soon. to have this back. So it's on top of here. Revelio. So, broom. Why in the first place the letter is here? Oh, just as I thought. Any materials here? What do we get? Astral mosaic rope. Revelio. Is that it? Okay. Now we know where to find this place in order to make wiggle well. That's great news. Get out of here. Oh, more hot clumps. I should find Mrs. Sprottle. She'll be glad to get these hot clumps. On another adventure, are we? Morning. Dark box sighting. Be careful. Uh, that's a great warning. Appreciate it's it. Like a place right out of a store. Bardo Beaumont should have returned by now. Had by dark wizards he was. Hello, Mrs. Sprottle. I have good news. I was able to harvest some hawk clumps for you, and I found Sorona's box of letters. Oh, thank you. How wonderful. The traveling vendors will be thrilled to replenish their stock of wig and weld potion. And Serona will be delighted to have those letters. How kind of you. Now you be careful heading back to Hogsmeade. Will do. I Thanks, man. this box of letters to Serona. She'll be glad to have it back. All right, here we go. Serona. Thank God we got fast travel. What are you up to now? Nothing. I am up to nothing. Hey, Serona. I'll say it again. Hello. Courage to go into the forest. Hello, Sorona. I have good news. I was able to provide your friend Mrs. Sprottle with some hawk clumps for her Wigamel potion, and I found your box of letters. Oh, thank you. I knew you were the one to ask. Be to help. I'm glad I could be of help. Mrs. Sprottle sends her best. Don't know what I'd have done without her and Aiden. Thank you, again, for helping her. And for returning this box of letters. It's nice to reflect on good memories. I'm glad you help. Actually. Okay. Ooh, 100 each. Damn, I think I need to do a bunch of side quests, right? Okay, this is a good place. So, that will be all for today. So thank you so much for watching. Do leave a like and subscribe if you like the video. It will help me tremendously. So yeah, have a good one guys. Bye bye.